Good morning! This is the Jersey Hermit with another retro video game stream, and today we're continuing Earthbound. I'll turn my controller on. I'll load up the game. Hoping everyone's having a good morning. Um, I mean, Christmas is coming soon, so I'm going to actually start my Christmas shopping today. All right. So when we last went, we were in the department store, and a spook had taken Paula. We got to get her back. First fight is against a scalding coffee cup. Ooh. Okay, that hits very hard. Another coffee cup. I want to fight it quick because once I get it killed, my, my HP doesn't drop anymore. Present is a cup of coffee. Okay, we'll take it. Go in here. Anything good in here? Nope. Okay, two fights this two guys this time. Cup of coffee and a mystical record. Let's hit him hard, huh? Yeah, it looks like we're gonna have to heal. Life up nest, that's the more important one. That's not good. Well, I go up to level 37. And I do not have... So what I'm going to do, actually, is I'm going to reset the game, and we're going to start this from the last save point, because I can't go. I, I am not letting myself lose Jeff there without any healing, because I can't get out, I don't think. Oh, I can, okay. I thought I was locked in for some reason. Okay. So, from now on, we don't do that. We heal if we have to. Another coffee cup. All right. So, status wise, remind me, yeah. So, we're going to use 10 H, 10 psychic points to heal up a bit. Go up to the next level. Three of them here. 
Yeah, hit all of them. Save those big bottle rockets for later, but I will use the bomb on the scalding coffee cup. Okay. Cheap attacks. But we got them both out. Nesta 37, HP 2, PP 1. Okay, cool. Ness, customer Ness, please hurry to Paula. Oh, boy. Up to the fourth floor. All right. Two mystical records. First things first, Jeff could die, so we're going to heal. Just to cover. Yeah, the charge forward's what I have to worry about. Life up quick. Get me back on the good graces. Okay. We can take that. One more fight. It's a Musica. Musica has thunder attacks. And we can block them with the Franklin badge, so that's good. Ness, customer Ness. Uh-huh, yeah. You finally made it. This department store is going to be your grave. You'll be gone and you'll be burning in... Well, you'll go to heaven. Okay. Hit him hard. We'll take it. Jeff goes to 34, offense 1, IQ 1, HP 1. We'll take it. Even though you could beat me, Master Gygus will avenge me. At this moment, Paula should be Monotoli. Hmm. Lights are back on. The power supply to the game was cut off. I wasted my money. All right, another camera picture. Heard it sound like war and it was loud. I was wondering if someone was fighting. Certainly it's very dangerous living in the city. Yeah, nothing. Down we go. That's right, I did the shopping last week. I was sitting here because I was scared. No, you weren't. So if the hint was Monotoli, I guess that's where we're going. I like the lights would get turned off in the department store. All right. Alright, 
to the Monotoli building. Last night there was a... Yeah. Hey, we did this already. Hold on. So where we need to go, actually, is to Jackie's Cafe. There's the hospital. There's the cafe. I'm surprised you talk to an ordinary guy like me. I have no information or items to help you out. Don't you think it's natural for a guy like me to be here? Yeah, I guess so. I enjoy the atmosphere. By the way, let me quiz you. There were five apples. If you eat one, how many are left? Right, so four's left. It's not funny? Okay, here's another one. Master Pokey's made Electra is made to order. Oh, puns aren't funny. No, puns are funny. That one's just not a good one. I was in the middle of a caffeine buzz, and I had to get to the bathroom fast. When I got there, I accidentally knocked on the wall instead of the restroom door. The next thing I knew, someone asked, who is it, and really surprised me. Maybe I just imagined it. I used to be Monotoli's employer, then I realized his schemes made my company go bankrupt. My house and land were taken away, now I'm homeless. Monotoli didn't used to be so powerful. I want to find out his secret, so I'm spending my time here watching to see if he ever drops in. There's a loud noise outside. Must be the seventh inning stretch, and the fans are singing Take Me Out to the Ball Game at the Stadium. What? Does Mr. Geldegard Monotoli come here awful? Hello, time to get up. It could never happen. Well, actually, that's not true. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to go like that. I'm glad it wasn't me. That looks like Everdread. There's a person lying on the ground. I wonder if he's... he's there's a he doesn't look like a nice man. Ooh, I don't like seeing a corpse around here. Don't cut in front of me. If you give me something, I'll let you have my spot. Yeah, what do I get? You can have that cup of coffee that I just... Are you sure? Yeah. All right, take my place. He's breathing. Has he just been playing too hard? Jeez. Aren't you Ness? I can't see too well. Everything's blurry. You are Ness, aren't you? It's me. We met in Tucson, Everdread from Berglund Park. You must remember, I'm the best thief around. That car painter in Happy Happy Village was hiding something. Strange. I stole it and thought about selling it in the big city. An old city wise man called it Mani Mani. It's a strange colored doll looking thing. Oh, I'm in pain. And Monotoli tricked me and stole it from me. He tricked a thief. He wanted me out of the way because I know his secret. He gets his evil power from that statue. Listen, I'll tell you only once. At the cafe, check behind the counter. I said I'd tell you only once, but if you insist, I'll tell you. No. Before you go, here's my last haiku. When on your way out, be sure that you say goodbye, then lock the door tight. This is my final request. Don't follow me. I must be on my way. So long. Oh, he isn't dead after all. Okay. Now, someone knocked on the door and said, oh, Yeah, you go here. And you end up in Moonside. No, that's right. I am the host here. What? Foresight? Are you still sleeping? This is Moonside. Yes, that's wrong. I am the hostess here. And we fight the Robo Pump. You want to get this guy dead in three turns. Because otherwise it'll throw the bomb and hit us both. Ness misses home. That's not good. That means that Ness is homesick. Yes is no, and no is yes. It makes perfect sense in Moonside. All right. Welcome to Moonside. Welcome to Moonside. 
If you stay here too long, it'll end up frying your brain. Yes, you will. No, you will not. Yes, no, you will. Won't. Okay. See if we can't find her. So, every now and again, until I get homesickness cured, Ness will do nothing. So we want to get that fixed. Refreshing herb. That's beautiful. Welcome to Moonside. Welcome to Soon Mine. Moonwell at Kosidmi. Do you understand all this? No, you don't? Tell you the truth, neither do I. Remember, yes is no, no is yes in this place. An enraged fire plug. Oh, that hurts. There we go. Okay, we gotta heal up. Nest to 38, offense 1, max HP 1, PP 1, and flash beta. Great. Where's the hotel? I can sense that you have a controller in your hands. There's the hotel. $75 for one sleep period for a single room. Alright. That's $150. Dark Moon, one sleep period, 100. Do you want to sleep? No. Good morning. Uh, not morning. Here in Moonside, it's always the middle of the night. Headline from tonight's Moonside Press. Manny Manny is always Manny Manny at Manny Manny with all Manny Manny Manny. <laughs> Look at things I would say not to. Do you need anything? You can buy. I know I'm going to need a hamburger. Eventually. But I'm going to check something. I think. Yeah, I have hamburgers here. Okay, good. Let's talk to Mom. What's wrong? You sound so sad. Are you homesick? Well, I knew there'd be days like this. It must make you feel better listening to your mom's sweet voice. You feel any better? Well, I better get going. I'm in the middle of my ironing. Got over being homesick. While we're at it, we're going to talk to Dad. And save the, the game. And we're going to take our first 60-second ad break. I take one every 20 minutes or so. I will see you at the end of this 60-second break. See what we can do now that we're fully healed. There's the hospital. 
I'm pretty forgetful. I even forget why I'm here. I just forgot something. Who am I? Am I a man? I'll send you first and then you second to the hospital. Literally. All right. Let's do this. And we're getting experience, so there, there's nothing bad here about fighting. And we get the abstract art. There we go. Dinosaur Museum. How about I sharpen you? I just love sharpening. You don't want me to sharpen? Uh, okay then. You, the Dolly's Clock. Okay. Get the kill quick and not lose as much HP. Everyone is someone, don't you think so? Yeah, we do. Oh, get him. The enraged fire plug. I do not like fighting enraged fire plugs. We want to fight them quick so we don't lose HP. Hello and goodbye. Warp time. The Manny Manny statue is up ahead, but I'm going to stop you right here. Don't even think about getting past me because you aren't with a guy whose eyebrows are connected and who also has a gold tooth. Okay. So we got to find a guy with connected eyebrows and a gold tooth. What's your problem? If you don't want anything, get out of here. I'm counting backwards. Okay. The abstract art don't do anything to me. Alright. Let's see. Alright. We gotta fight, and it's two things. An enraged fire plug and a robo pump. I'm hitting them both. Okay, the fire plug is out. And so is the Robo Pump. Jeff to 35, offense 2, defense 1, guts 1, max HP 1. To the hospital. Okay, it's not that warp. Yes means no, no means yes. Or did you already know this? Yes, I did. Okay. Double burger inside. Nice. Hypnosis, huh? Ness fell asleep. That's not good. 
Okay. We avoided that problem. What we got? Wh which which fire problem? The robo pump. Okay, that's not terrible. There we go. Let's try this guy. That's the same guy as before. Okay, that's not the one we want. This guy out. Nest to 39, offense 1, speed 1, guts 1, vitality 1, IQ 1, HP by 12, PP by 2, and life up Sigma. Oh, we've got a free attack, too. Okay. The good thing is sleep doesn't persist. I don't think. That's green. Hello, Soft. How you doing this morning? We know it's not this guy. Let's try this one. No. Good morning. Busy day at work, but I'm in bed. Fair enough. Working from my laptop. Nope, dodge you. Where's the warp guy I want? Sure. The one in front of the hospital, maybe? Is it colder? It's actually, it was snowing a little bit. Um, night pendant. I think I can equip that. Oh. Jeff. Yeah, we'll put the night pendant on. It was, it was flurrying a bit. Um wall there. Okay. Um, it's not sticking any. I'm so jealous. I want a little bit of snow. You know, I, I want a little bit of snow this year. We've not gotten any really in the last two years. Take this warp. A handbag strap. I spy my little eye. I see a country in summer and a big silver ball. You're burnt, but you're fine. This is what I see. Let's try this warp. Before the soup gets cold, we must care for Mani Mani. Before the knife gets rusty, we must care for not Mani Mani. Yep, we'll do that. Can you see me? You can, huh? You've become a real moon city and haven't you? Okay, we've talked there. That you're looking for some kind of door where you're not gonna find one. So get out of my face, loser. I have no patience when people interrupt me while I'm busy doing nothing. Ah, it's me. You can see me, right? There's something interesting about you, so I'm going to follow you. Don't worry, though. If you get into a fight, I'll stay out of it. You can't see me, right? Save. 
and I'm going to heal up while I'm at it. Don't you wish you had a gold tooth like mine? Give me a smile. Don't you think my eyebrows rock? Check them out. They're connected. This guy sent me where I needed to be. I thought. No. That's not the one I want. I love the designs of the buildings. Yeah, th this is supposed to be the weirdo area. A secret herb that I cannot pick up. What do I want to get rid of? I don't use handbag straps. Oops. Okay, we're going to have to fight this one at disadvantage. Are we constantly high on this secret herb? The trees flashing in neon. Yeah, this game is trippy. Believe you me. Um, and no, that's not the secret herb that does that. <laughs> okay. Song was amazing. Get out through here. find my way to the right entrance the right guy it's not the guy in front of the hospital it's one of these guys I just happen right here huzzah you really surprised me you're the man whose eyebrows are connected and who has a gold tooth how about we dump these kids and go get something to drink fight the uh, the dolly's clock is saying TikTok. All right, we got to fight that through. Don't do anything to me. I am I am not Monotoli. It is a golden statue that you have seen before. Yeah, we saw this in Car Painter's place. Evil Mani Mani attacks. All right. We got another big bottle rocket. We're going to use it on this fight. Stealing. Hit this thing hard. He's attacking. Okay. There we go. Jeff to 36, offense 1, defense 2, speed 3, vitality 1, IQ by 3, luck by 3, HP by 10. The Mani Mani statue was actually a device that created illusions. The illusion device was destroyed. You were wandering around the warehouse with a vacant, faraway look in your eyes. Were you daydreaming? This is Apple Kid. I've come up with another wacky invention that I think has real potential. Maybe you won't, but anyway, it's called the Gourmet Yogurt Machine. It makes many different flavors of yogurt. The only problem is right now it can only make trout-flavored yogurt. So I'm having the machine delivered to you via Escargot Express. It's coming neglected class. Hopefully you'll get it soon. Everything is... Uh, I've got some problems here. got to go by. Okay, I have room for an item.
I'm not a delivery man. I can't remember if we've met. Talarama just finished fasting and now wants to meet you at the west end of Dusty Dunes Desert in a cave with lots of monkeys. I'll use my teleportation to... Bye. Okay. Oops, crunk, oops. Greetings. It's Escargo's Express Neglected Class. I just got here from the Dusty Dune Desert. There was this sunbathing guy, and he told me about a cave with lots of monkeys, or was it orangutans? Anyway, he said, well, uh, I forgot. Yep, I forgot. Actually, I forgot the stuff I was supposed to deliver to. I think it was some weird machine to make trout-flavored yogurt. I forgot in the desert. I'm not going back that way, so don't ask me to get the package. I mean, it's your package, right? So you go get it. Maybe that thing I forgot is important to you, so have a good time in the desert. Hello, I heard you talking about trout-flavored yogurt. I'm a maid who serves Mr. Monotoli, and I'm looking for trout-flavored yogurt to give to our special guest. If you know anything about it, please tell me. I've been searching and searching. I guess I'm going to the desert. All right. Let's head to the desert, then. Wait a minute. West End, right? Yeah, I'm just going to go to the hotel. We're going to pay for the, uh, the, the privilege. It's $4. And there's a chance, every time I do this, there is a chance that Jeff's going to fix that pipe and get me my shield killer. Okay, Ness is almost to another level. So cute. They did a great job with the art. Yes, they did. Also, this game is available on um, Nintendo Switch Online. So, uh, you might want to try it. it. It's worth it. This continues on to Tucson. You want to get off here? Yes, I do. Cave we wanted is right here. Yeah, they they don't want any pieces of us. Level 40, offense 5, defense 2, speed 1, guts 1, IQ 2, luck 2, HP 2, and PP by 10. Alright. Do you have a skip sandwich? I'll move away if you give me one. There we go. A picnic lunch. I don't have one. We'll go this way.
There's a wet towel inside. Okay. A protein drink. I don't think I have one. No, I don't. If you have a pizza. Spoke to you in the human's language. If you have a pizza. I don't have one of those. Yeah, wet towel is an item in this game that cures sunstroke. So I need a picnic lunch. And if I remember correctly... I can buy one in here. Yep, there one is. Amen. Sell the great charm that I don't need anymore. Buy the picnic lunch. We're going to use some of this money to see if we can't get what I want. No. Alright. Now, if I remember correctly, the picnic lunch is actually one of the two things you do have to bring in, and a hamburger is the other. Because everything else that a monkey is going to ask you for, I can find in here. But I'm going to take an ad break right now. I will see you in 60 seconds. Let's try this again. Don't bother with the fight. Picnic lunch. We just got one. Great. There's a pizza inside. Cool. Ooh, I'm Mankana. I want to eat a tasty pizza. Yeah, I've got a pizza. Thank you, Soft. Ah, Mankana's happy. Keep going. There's another pizza back there. Amongst all these rooms, you should be able to obtain Dragonite. Do you think Dragonite is really made from dragons? By the way, I'll give you a fresh egg. If you run out, I'll come back and I'll give you another as many eggs as you want. Okay. So we gotta figure I know one of these monkeys wants an egg. Hers all sweaty. A wet towel. I will give you the wet towel. Okay. 
a hamburger. A ruler. I uh, come back for the ruler. I love hamburgers. The monkey next to me. Yeah, we'll give you the hamburger. Come on. Move. Move out of the way. A flame pendant inside. There we go. Great charm can go away now. Uh, we're going to come back to that. HP. <laughs> Little Sprouts had no chance. Here we needed protein drink. This is the pizza. Okay. In here is a protein drink. Man K Man to me is the king banana. I don't have one. To the point. Give me a hamburger. I don't have one. But now I have a protein drink. And I have not done it quick enough. That's okay. I have a chick. There's a hamburger. Okay. Strange shattering for a monkey. If I eat a fresh egg, I don't have one anymore. Oh, I want to measure something, but I don't have a ruler. Do you have one I can borrow? Okay. Get rid of the chick. I do not need the chick. Okay, fre okay. Don't bother. I have a hamburger. And there is the bag of Dragonite. Nice. You want the king banana. Okay. Neat music, though. Yeah, this was the fresh this was the fresh egg, right? Yeah. Did you find a flame pendant? Oh no, you don't have to answer. Here's another fresh egg. Alright. Now we have to do this quick ish. Don't fight. It's on this side. There's my fresh egg. Ba 
back here. A neutralizer. Nice. Now I need a ruler, and I remember seeing there was a ruler. But I also have no room to pick stuff up, so I need to... I'm going to sell my um, Great Charm. Another chance to get the he the right, fix the broken pipe became the shield killer. That's what I wanted. Go find that ruler, huh? Okay. Let's see. Where was the ruler? Through past the wet towel. I am so relaxed. Great music and the birds chirping. Fresh egg. There's the ruler. Absolutely am I not fighting that mushroom. I think it's this way. It's the ruler I need to get. Right. I don't have a ruler. Do you have one I can borrow? Yeah, you can have my ruler. Finally, I can measure my own tail. Come on, move. Thank you. One of my friends can use the teleport. What? You've never heard of it? Then I'll give you King Banana. That didn't make sense, did it? But anyway, I'm attractive, don't you think? The King Banana. And I remember there was a monkey who wanted the King Banana. So, time to find him. Do I get this fight free at least? Yes, I do. Okay. I think it was... 
is this way. I am Man K Man. To me, the most interesting thing is the King Banana. Are you giving me a present? The King Banana. Oh, I've died and gone to monkey heaven. Oh, it's going to be a fight against all of them, is it? All right. We're using rock and beta. Because I want that strut and mushroom gone. Okay, in here. There's a hamburger. And a picnic lunch. Hold off on the picnic lunch. I love Talarama the most. He's a friend of the monkeys. Here's a song I made up for Talarama. There's a pencil statue. Well, we know how to deal with that. The pencil eraser. The truth of space and time moves through the universe like a wave. Truth speaks through space and matter and makes itself known to human beings. I was waiting for you and you came. This was destined to happen. The truth all is predetermined. Ness, Paula, Jeff, and Pooh, when these four powers gather, twisted space will bring back peace to the world. Do you understand? It doesn't matter. Proceed as you wish. Open the treasure box and take what is inside with you. Did you come and search for this? Someone left in the hole. You cannot carry anything else. Why don't you get rid of something you don't need? You will need this, the gourmet yogurt machine. Um, okay. The Magnum Air Gun I can't sell. The Coin of Slumber I can. We're going to drop the Double Burger for now. Tuck this out. and get the yogurt machine. Special skill to move space. Learn the skill from the monkey over there. It's wonderful. Speak to the monkey over there. I'll teach you teleportation. Let's go outside. What's in here? A brain food lunch and a cup of life noodles. Okay. I'm not really worried about those, but I do want to trade out that hamburger. Not worried about the picnic lunch either. Now, from here, picnic lunch and hamburger, where is what I want. Right. Okay. We want to go out this way, past what used to be a protein drink, out here, out here. Okay, so it's left, then right, then left again. Cool. Left. Right. Take the hamburger. And get a broken tube. Alright. Now eventually we're going to have to give that to... Uh, 
uh, Jeff to try to fix. Welcome. Repair it. No, it's not that one. Okay. Follow me like this way. All right, we can do that. Okay, I'll do a teacher's demonstration. If you can learn this, you can go anywhere you've been previously. You can go there instantly. This skill can't be used in a room or underground, though. I went to Foresight and returned. I showed you the basic straight course, but you can also build up enough speed while turning if you have enough room. Why don't you try it, young man? Ness learned how to use PSI teleportation. Great. Okay, the teacher is going home now. All right. So we can't sell the Magnum air gun, but we can sell the um, Queen of Slumber. Okay, deposit. All but eighteen. All but one hundred and fifty-eight dollars. So that's uh, ninety-two. Five ninety-two. Yep, that'll do it. We're gonna do a pickup. Walk around a bit. Yep. Take three things, right? Okay. We're going to have you take the Magnum air gun. Um, the insecticide spray. And... I don't want the bad key machine taken. Right, the Magnum air gun. The insecticide spray. We're going to take the super bomb, too. Yep. All right. And I'm going to take an ad break real quick. I'll see you in 60 seconds. We are back. Good. Take that broken tube and give it to Jeff. And we're going to rest up again just to make sure. Maybe I'll get a heal. Maybe I'll get a, a build. Broken tube becomes the hungry HP sucker. 
Nice. That was worth it. So we're going to warp to four side. And head to the Monotoli building. Kept asking around, what? You have a yogurt dispenser? May I have it? Before you can answer, she took the yogurt. Now I can make trout flavored yogurt for my guests. You also are kind, I'll make some for you. My room's on the 48th floor. Don't forget to drop by. All right, let's do this. Only if it goes directly to the 47th. Yeah, stand somewhere else beside. Aren't you, Ness? Mr. Monotoli's maid, Electra, told me about you. I'll take you to Mr. Monotoli's office on the 48th floor. Only you may go. Let's go. Secret code plays see your code in 10 seconds. I don't have a code. Just beat the crap out of it. Fired a beam. There we go. Try here first. Another sentry bot. Fired the bottle rocket. We're going to heal up. In a second. Yeah, it's good. Good, it missed me. We'll go up and up again. Find another sentry robot. aren't terrible. <laughs> All right, in here is a sudden guts pill. How about this way? Another one of these blasted robots. If anything, we're going to get more, um... Okay. 
get rid of these guys. There we go. Hey, we get triple the uh, the XP there. Your trout flavored yogurt. Master Pokey's cool. He gave me something the other day and said, this is fit for a maid. Okay. Let's see. One life up there. And one life up here. Clankety, clankety, rattle out, squeak, twit, twit, clank. Oh, we got a fight. Clumsy robot. Reapply to bandage. Stumbled but fired a crazy... We just gotta keep hitting it. Ate a bologna sandwich. It's not really healing him, believe it or not. There we go. Oh, crap. All right. Let's take the life up. Come on! All of a sudden, some guys rushed into the room. It was the Runaway 5. Lucky quickly ducked behind the robot. I flipped the switch and it stopped. Jeez, what a low loser robot. It was so easy to stop. That was quick thinking. Nesta 41, HP 1, PP 1, and Jeff 37, Offense 1, Guts 1, HP 2. We'll take it. We don't have any money. We are strong, however. We'd like to pay you back. We'll help you in whatever way we can. I thought I heard a girl's voice. Let's break into the room next door, except I need to go to the bathroom first. Room next door seems suspicious somehow. Stop. That's enough. Please stop. I give up. I really do. Yes, you finally made it here. I'm fine. I'd believe you'd come and save me. Mr. Monotoli isn't really a bad person. Take some time to listen to him. Look at my skinny arms, thin body, and gray hair. I've become so weak since I've lost the Manny Manny statue. I'm sorry I kidnapped Paula. I haven't done anything to her. Paula's a nice girl. Paula, return to Ness. I'm sorry I've created so much trouble for you. All right. Joined you. I'll tell you everything. The Manny Manny statue creates an illusion. It attracts evil spirits and weakens your heart. The power scared me so much I hid the statue in the warehouse at Jackie's Cafe. I often went there to pray. Cryptic words appeared to me while I was in the illusion. Ness, your name appeared in the cryptic messages. Stop Ness and do so by your own hand. Or don't let them go to Summers. Or make sure they know nothing of the pyramid. I don't fully understand the messages, but someone obviously doesn't want you to go to Summers. Evil Gygus or something, I could hear the name. Anyway, the evil side would be in trouble if you visit Summers. Oh, on the contrary, you should definitely go to Summers, especially because they don't want you to make it there. Would you like to hear the whole story again? No. Summers is located across the ocean. Take my helicopter. I'll open the door to my heliport. Okay. You must go on, Ness. This is your destiny. Paul, it's time we said goodbye. Take care. There goes the helicopter.
Nancy, you pinheaded eight years. The half test to too slow. I'm getting out of here. Since Monotoli has been a plain old man again, I have no more use for him. This helicopter will really come in handy. Looks like you're the world class loser again. Okay then. Pokey took the helicopter. I only hope he's okay. Alright. Looks like. Ooh, I was a little dizzy, but now I'm okay. To get to Summers, we need to go back to Threed. Yep, somehow I know that's where we must go. You guys did a lot while I was in the bathroom. When I get to Threed as soon as possible, we can take you to Threed North and North Northwest. I'll get the bus and wait for you just outside the building. All right. But we didn't go in this way. There's a vital capsule inside. We'll take that. Hello, how are you? This is Apple Kid. I think I'm a real genius. In fact, I know I'm a genius. Why? Well, I've discovered the primary enemy of you and of all humanity. We have to fight and defeat this being. To do so, we need to invent a machine called the Phase Distorter. I've got to find the wandering scientist, Dr. Andonuts, and make the distorter. So I may be gone for a while. Later. Okay. Are you a friend of the Runaway Five? Would an autograph be asking for too much? I don't mean your autograph, silly. anything in here anymore. Nope. Get on the bus now. Let's do this. All right, on to three. All right, we made it. I'm sorry we couldn't do more for you. Remember, though, we're on your side. When you're having a tough time, just think of our songs and imagine the Runaway Five singing somewhere far, far away. By the way, why did you need to come back here? You must have got forgotten some very important item or gadget. How's that for a guess? Am I close? Well, you don't have to tell me. See you later and good luck. 
All right. Well, yeah, the Skyrunner is here. If I remember correctly, the passage to it is in the graveyard. Can't see the problem. I need to be in the front. We painted all over all the damaged parts of the Skyrim. Now, I wonder how you start this thing up. I want you to stay, but if you can't, so long. Thanks for every little old thing. Ah, here's the problem. It's not too tough to fix. Hang on for a second or two. There. That should do it. Now, if we board, the Skyrim will take us back to Winters. With Dr. Andernut's help, I can modify the machine to fly to Summers. If Dad, I mean Dr. Andernut's, is not available, I'll have to figure it out by myself. Anyway, let's go back to the lab in Winters. That's it. Go, machine, go. desert again. Fly over four side. back into the lab. Thanks for taking care of my husband the other day. Oh yes, we finally tied the knot. Honey, don't just stand there with your mouth open. Stay, say hello. So, you passed by a cave north of Stonehenge. Don't you ever wonder what's inside? Can't seem to stop thinking about it. Go and see what's there. We're going to get out of here. We're still newlyweds, you know. Bye-bye. Okay. Oh, you surprised me. You're Ness, aren't you? Jeff wets his bed sometimes, but other than that, he's a good boy. Take care of yourself with Jeff. The bubble monkey said there's a cave north of Stonehenge. I've known about it for a long time. The locals call the area Rainy Circle, but I haven't been there. I wonder what's inside the cave. I, I understand. While you're checking out the place, I'll work on remodeling the Skyrunner. My co-worker Bigfoot decides violence. He's a nice guy and he loves people. He often shares his beef jerky with me. And I need to take an ad break, so I will see you in 60 seconds.
All right, we're back. Let's see what we can do. Right, do that first. May I help you? What would you like? I can buy stuff, which I don't have money to buy. All right. All right, let's do this. Out we go to Rainy Circle. These don't look right. Let me say, these stones are making a pattern. It's called Stonehenge. UFOs off seen in, yes, that's Stonehenge. Yeah, don't fight if we don't have to. Into the cave. The fourth your sanctuary location. It is shrewd. Okay. First things first, we're gonna try flash beta. We're gonna throw fire. Ness went strange. Oh, that's not good. Okay, defend with that. Fire him again. Goods. Use the bag of Dragonite. Okay. We might do this. Real easy. Goods. Try it again. Did not work. Jeff got poisoned. I don't want to throw anything. Nest to 42. Offense 2. Guts 1. HP 3. PP 2. Okay, here's some boosts. Paul is 35. Offense 1. Speed 1. IQ. Luck 1. Max H3. PP 2. And also to 36. Offense 4. Speed 3. Guts 2. Vitality 1. IQ 3. HP XP. Jeff's to 38. Offense to 1. IQ 1. HP 2. Okay. We'll take it, and I'm not worried about the poison right now, because once I get to Rainy Circle, everything's going to clean up. Ness caught a whiff of steak, but just for a second. Okay. We're in Rainy Circle. We're done with Rainy Circle. And now we have four. Oh boy. Well, at least we're fully healed. The Mighty Bear 7 and its Cave Boy cohorts. Let's hit them all. Really? Okay. Offense. Yeah, just hit them hard, I think. There we go. There 
There we go. That's not bad at all. And now that we got that taken care of... Wait a minute. There's something else I can do. And I, and I can use the X... I can use the XP. I remember there was a pencil eraser. Or was an erase a pencil statue around here. Let's get that taken care of. The strong crocodile. <laughs> And an elder baddie. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm not going to get the goods. That's right, you can only use yours. He doesn't have, she doesn't have it. So we're going to live with Paula being unconscious for now. And try not to fight too much. Yeah, they run away from me because I've cleared the stat, I've cleared the, um, cleared the sanctuary, so... And it's right here. Now, can I use... I can... Okay, I can do that. Because then I can use the Cup of Life noodles on Paula. There's the Brick Road Dungeon. Ness is full. Paula's full. Do that. What we got? The Woolly Shambler and the Whirling Robo. Just hit them hard. freeze on the one. That'll do it. Nest to 43. Defense 1. Vitality 2. HP 24. Nice. All right. Now we can go back. El two elder baddies and an arachnid. Fire the back row. Shoot the arachnid. Well, the arachnid's gone. That was worth it. Okay. Here we 
go. Just the two baddies? Alright. Okay. It can do that. There we go. Paula to 37 HP, uh, XP, HP 1 and Fire Sigma. Or I fire Gamma, I'm sorry, it's Gamma. Nope, it's not that way. Let's see how powerful this Gamma is. Not bad. Not bad at all. No, it's up here. Because there's Rainy Circle. And we got this fight again. Run Thunder, why not? Okay. Blood with its sharp nails. Uh oh. Heal quick. There we go. All right. Jeff to thirty nine, IQ one, HP three. Cool. Now back to the lab. the revitalizing device. Call dad. $55,000 in the bank. We'll take it. Save. Oh, nice. Jeff. Self and Jeff. You found something out. I finished remodeling the Skyrunner. You can leave for summers whenever you wish. It shouldn't break this time. Well, maybe. Let's go. Off to summers. Well, we're here. I'm actually a surfer, but you can't surf at this beach. Should I become a porter so I can get tips from all the old folks? And we have a sign.
The crazed sign. Alright. At least we'll put them out real quick. The sky's blue and the sun is high. The prices here are so high it'll make your face turn blue. That's Summers. Alright. Alright. Picture time's over. 150 bucks per night. Ew. Alright. Let's try to find Pokey, huh? He's got to be around here somewhere. wonder why such serious-looking kids as you would come to this resort town. You guys are spoiling the atmosphere. Oh, well, we got the shop. To my store. What do you need? We can do better than this in prices. Lose, we're not buying, get out. All right. This is not the Stoic Club. Please be on your way. It is the Stoic Club. If you're bored, go check out the Scaraba Culture Museum. It may be helpful to you. They have a hieroglyph from a pyramid. Later on. Another crazed sign. Let's see. Another nice day. Summers always has sunny days. There's the hospital. Hotel. There's graffiti on the board. The handwriting Ness can eat my shorts. For a neighbor, he's a loser. East of here is the port town of Toto. No, I'm not Billboard. Okay. To go to Scarabia, you need to cross the sea. Over a monster named Kraken lives in the open sea. He attacks ships that pass through. Are you scared? And we got a shop. You ought to shop here. Things are expensive down there. What do we got? Nothing again. And I like the pirate accent. Would you like a boat ride? Yes. I don't feel like sending a ship out. I'm worried about my wife. I'm not afraid of the Kraken. My wife's totally ignoring her magic cake business. These days, she spends her time hanging out in a strange club. We no longer have any mutual interests in Is our relationship over? So she's probably at the Stoic Club. Dinosaurs exist. I saw one had been out of the underground when it dried out. Of course it was dead. Believe what I'm saying. Okay. Meow. Now, cat there. Bow. Now, brown cow. If you come closer, I'll play the trumpet. Uh, I don't know how to play yet. Okay. Nothing in here. I don't want to go out to sea because of the Kraken. I mean, any normal person would feel the same way. Do you know the Stoic Club in Summers? You need to call a secret number for a reservation if you want to get in. What? Yeah, I'll give you the secret number. I warn you, though, it's a strange place. Well, now I have the number for the Stoic Club. Hello, Jeff. Oh, happy day. I finally got a hold of you. Oh, Jeff. Hi, it's me, Tony. I'm collecting players' names for a school project. You know players just like you. That's right, you, the one holding the controller. Would you register your name, please? Don't spell your name wrong. All right, we'll do that. And once I'm done with this, I need to take an ad break, so... Wait a minute. 
I screwed up. There we go. Thanks, game player. Thank you very much. Is this correct? Yes, it is. Focus gun. Apologize for any trouble this may cause you. Don't put my friend Jeff in any dangerous situations, okay? I worry about him. I really do. Well, talk to you later, Jeff. I hope I can see you again when you're feeling up to it. From Tony. You got that? Well, I've been on the phone too long. Gotta go. Good luck. Take care. So long. This time, I'm really gonna hang up. Goodbye. Beep. Ad break time. See you in 60 seconds. Okay, we're back. Let's do this. Uh, okay, so we need a reservation at the Stoic Club. I'm a grave robber. I was scared of the Pyramid and Scrabble, so I didn't go in. But I tell people I saw mummy-type monsters with my very own eyes. Okay, then. So, I need a phone. I'll just pay the dollar. Hello, this is the Stoic Club. Oh, Ness, sir, would you like to make a reservation? Certainly. We are looking forward to having you here. Thank you. Problem solved. Off to the Stoic Club. Past the museum. In we go. I finally awakened the inner me, the true self. The patrons of this club are able to stare into their own soul hard enough to burn a hole in their psyche. I'm now comfortable enough to stare at the real me, the true self, and burn the impression into my superego. I want to be in this comfort zone at any time, all the time, or at no time. My id is telling me. Didactically speaking, 7-Eleven seems to explicate the fact that your repu repudiation of entropy supports my theory of space-time synthesis. Of this, I am irrefutably confident. You guys can't envision the final collapse of capitalism? I wish. Incredible. Hmm, I think it's a very complicated issue. Oh, sorry, I was sleeping. The show? It's already started. Everyone stares at the stone on stage and philosophizes. Doesn't it sound stupid? You don't understand what the hey everyone's talking about, do you? I don't either, but I try to be patient with the customers. They pay high prices just for a glass of water and the chance to have serious intellectual discussions. Actually, it's an easy business. You want a drink? We only serve water, though. You know, I really want to eat some magic cake. It's a mysterious work of art. I can't get that cake off my mind. There's only one woman who can make magic cake. She's hanging out in this club. Yeah, she's over there at the entrance. Anyway, the absolute irony and study of self-identification is blah, blah, blah. I don't know what to do. Let's see. Talk this. Maybe this will... Want to be in this comfort zone at no time. My it is telling me, what, what, magic cake? You came all the way just to eat my magic cake? Yes, I see. Okay, why don't you stop by a little cart out on the beach later? Okay. Magic 
cake. Magic cake. That sounds like a drug. The question is, where's the magic cake stand? Just trying to take a nap in the shade. Don't bother me. tanning pro like me is able to get an actual suntan on the palms of his hands. You're around here somewhere. Got some really spectacular things. Gelato D Resort. It's a minor bird. If you're bored, go check out the carpet. It might be helpful to you. They have a hieroglyph from a pyramid. Okay. Let's see. Don't know who told you. Came from far off to see my magic cake. I thought making cakes would be the best career for me. Dig in. I used all leftover heroes. This is a very special magic cake. Okay then. Ness had a dream. It was a very clear and very strange dream. Dalam in the Far East. The Palace of Pooh, the Crown Prince. Prince Pooh, the time has now come for you to undertake your final trial. Go to the place of emptiness and endure this final test. I am praying for your success in this final stage of your training. Go quickly. Brain food lunch. A couple life noodles and a brainstone inside. Use the treasures of Dalam as you wish. Go in peace. That you ask, why are you disguising your voice like that? Who are you pretending to be? Oh well, it's not a big deal. I suppose you need to have a sense of humor to come. Experience the next level. Jack, yeah, it's poo. Uh, status. What level am I? Level 15. Okay. At least I don't start at level 1. Prince Pooh, you're my favorite. What is immortality? Is it everlasting life? Pooh, I'm surprised you're not in training. It seems like that's all you do. They want to take some time to play with me. I'm so lonely without you. Please come in. Look around the house as much as you want. Hello, Jersey. Hello, Floofer. How you doing today? Oh, Prince Pooh, do you have time to play with me? Happy me. Patty cake, patty cake. I just roasted some garlic and ate it so the room still stinks. See, garlic's a wonderful thing. Um, garlic, it makes you sleep real good. You sleep alone, but you sleep real good. 
I hear that Prince Pooh is deeply into moo training. I want to help him if I can. I love garlic. So do I. Garlic's one of those things you measure with your heart. Jar of deli sauce. You know that you do do everything well, right? Do do. Hey, Prince Pooh, are you still popular with the girls? You've been acting very serious lately. You measure with your heart and not your breath. Yeah, that'll work. We accept dollars. We have a bowl of rice gruel. And a bottle of water. Serve water, rice. What would you like? Pass. I don't have any money. Just by drinking water, even I hear the prince can do that. What is PP anyways? Yeah. You're such a hunk. What do we have here? As strange as this may sound, there are statues of rabbits blocking your way. Okay then. This is Moo, the place of nothing. People who train here must first clear everything from their mind. If you can make your mind blank and learn the true meaning of Moo, you'll pass through. Moo is Moo. You have nice eyes. You must be Prince Pooh. Long ago, I completed Moo training. I want to show you a higher level of intelligence. However, I'm still realizing and learning this high level. I'll see you again. So long. Moo. Yep. Up to the top. Ah, Prince Pooh, I am a messenger from your master. He sent me to tell you that you must stop your meditation immediately. Prince Pooh, you must come back with me instead of staying in a place such as this. Your master wishes it. Please rise, Prince. Your Highness, you must give up this trial for now. Believe what I say. It is the truth. No name. Just stay put. Prince Pooh, I am the spirit of your ancient lineage. To complete your trial, I am going to break your legs. You will use the, lose the use of them. Do you accept this? Yes. So, Prince Pooh, you cannot walk as your legs are broken. Next, I will tear your arms off. I shall then take your arms and feed them to the crows. The taking of your arms, do you accept this? Yes. Ah, Prince Pooh, without legs and arms, you can only lie there. Now I'll cut your ears off. You do not mind my taking your hearing away, do you? Do you accept this? Yes. Note, the sound goes away. So, Prince Pooh. No legs, no arms, and no sound. By floating words through the air, I must ask you, do you care if I take your eyes? Do you want to live in eternal darkness? I shall steal your sight. Do you accept this? Yes. So, Prince Pooh. Now I can only communicate directly with your mind. Your mind is all you have left. In the end, I will take your mind, though you probably didn't want to allow that, do you? You can't answer. You can't even move. Are you sad? Are you lonely? If you lose your mind, you also lose any feelings of sadness. Do you accept this? I will take your mind, Prince Pooh. Know that I will possess it. Prince Pooh, you have now completed your training. The old master must be so pleased. Hurry now and return to the palace. There we go. What if you say no? Well, you have to do it all over again. And I don't want to have to do it all over again. Same as if you move in that first spot. And you have to come all the way up here and do it again. I am proud. You have completed your mood training. There is nothing more to teach you from the Holy Writings. Prince Pooh, I shall relay a message to you from eternity. The evil entity that, is that controls all wickedness is preparing for the greatest struggle of all time. The only ones who can challenge the entity are three boys and one girl. One named Ness is the leader of the four. One of the boys is you, Prince Pooh. Have I ever played Quake? 
I played Quake back in the 90s, the original Quake. Now that you've completed your training, search out Ness at once. For all beings, for the Earth itself, I pray for growth and the might of the four. Level ups. S uh, offense by seven, defense by four, speed up, guts one, vitality one, IQ two, HP by 14, PP by eight, shield beta. 17, HP two, PP one, teleport alpha. 18, luck one, max HP three, PP two, teleport beta. My name is Pooh. I am the one who will fight beside you. I am the servant of Ness. I will obey Ness. Ness, my life is in your hands. Now, the lucky coins I can only I can get cheapest here. It's the only thing that is cheap enough here that is worth me doing. I started a few months ago, inspired by a friend who used to play in the 90s, competed in tournaments and all. Started with Quake Live and now playing Quake Champions. Okay. Withdraw. 24,000. Give that to Pooh so that everybody can pick something up straight. Okay. Another lucky coin goes to Paula. to Jeff. That worked. Okay. Put the money back. Okay, we're heading to the museum next. I miss my SNES. I can appreciate it. I kind of miss mine too. Part of the scary was being remodeled. You still want to enter. Yet yeah, $3 per person. You'll say here, you may enter free of charge. Oh, wait, I can't do that. Goodbye. Okay, I need money. Shop's gonna... Oh, that's Dad saying, yeah. Find a place you stay in the nearest hotel. Give your dad a call. Keep an eye out for bad guys. Yeah, right. Okay. We're not doing that, by the way. We are getting money, though. I need Mr. Spoon from the Foreside Museum try to call me. If he wants to brag about something, well, let him try it. When I want what he wants to tell me. Bye, I dare try it. Oh, pardon me. I was just talking to myself. Okay, now. Ram Raisins, the third's casket. The fourth's casket. The fifth's training pot. Toten Carmen's Pencil Box Casket 
I saw a chubby kid about your age here. It looked like he was awfully wealthy. He was being extravagant. Lunchbox. This room is being around, so can't you? Oh, the samurai kid is here. Will he be giving me that gem? You're such a good student. I'm impressed by your passion for learning. Come in. Excellent. Do you feel like you're really experiencing this great historical period? This experience is more valuable than a small gym. The other day, a rich kid came to Summers by helicopter. He also took a picture of the hieroglyphs. I got lots of money from him. Shattered Man. We can deal with them. We'll throw Freeze at it. Oh boy. That's a good move. And, and okay, if that's the case, then we're just going to freeze that way, too. There we go. A mummy wrap. Poo to 19. Offense 2, defense 2, speed 1, vitality 1, HP 10, PP 1, up to 20. Offense 5, defense 6, speed 2, guts 1, vitality 1, IQ 1, luck 1, HP by 15, PP by 1, level 21, HP by 3, PP by 2, Magnet Alpha. That was worth it. Let's get the other one. We know that you don't like freeze. So we're going to freeze it. There we go. Level 44 for Ness. Offense 6, Speed 1, Guts 2, IQ 2, Luck 3, HP by 1, PP by 5. Paul at a 38. Defense 1, Luck 1, Maximum HP 2, PP 2. Poo to 22. Offense 2, HP 1, PP 2. Level 23. Offense 1, Defense 2, Speed 1, HP 3, PP 2. Hey, we gained some levels. Poo read the hieroglyphs. To fight against the invaders, we built this pyramid fortress. However, our efforts were futile and we lost. Nonetheless, our pyramid was protected by the gods of Scaraba. The invaders will be reborn every millennium and will attack again. Even now, the invaders hide behind beyond space and time and build their evil stronghold. A place out of time is beyond the dark and even farther beyond the lost underworld. The deep darkness is shrouded. It is without light. Only one with the hawk eye can pierce the dark. The Sphinx now watches over everything, waiting for the coming of a truly brave hero. Dance in front of the Sphinx. Okay. Ness, let's go to Scarba. The pyramid is the key. Okay. So, we're going to take an ad break. I'll see you in 60 seconds. back. Wait one second. Here's a picture of the hieroglyphs just for you. It's a reward for studying so hard. Using your human civilization class. Okay. Let's do this. So we're going to check out the Dinosaur Museum first. Call. 
Hello, is this Mr. Fork of the Scarab Culture Museum? It doesn't sound like you. Well, I'll quickly tell you my story because I'm busy, busy, busy. I found so something so extraordinary that mere words could not do it justice. What do you mean, who am I? Don't you recognize my voice? It's me, Mr. Spoon, from the Foresight Museum of Natural History. Look, Mr. Fork, I'm not exaggerating this find. I'm telling you, it's fantastic. It's outrageous. Yeah, we're going there. Teleporting to... Foreside. And you have to have enough speed or else it'll waste, so... We go to Foreside. To the Dinosaur Museum. It's going to cost me to get in, I know that. Over here. HP is five dollars per person. Okay. I mean, it's late at the museum. I'll get twenty bucks. Actually, I'll get fifty bucks because I know that I'm going to need it for other things. Dinosaurs over there. Sure, I'm gonna still want to go see it. It's five dollars a piece. Let's do that. You'll find an academic researcher inside. I wonder how many animals go extinct before human beings discover them. I want to see a live dinosaur sometime in my life. Huge, not you. I'm talking about the dinosaur bones. You can sell dinosaur t shirts. You want to know about something extraordinary? You know, there's a new singer named Venus at the Topola Theater. Could you bring me her autograph on an eraser? Then I'll show you something extraordinary. Oh, if you can get her an autograph on anything, don't worry about the eraser. I don't care if the autograph is written on toilet paper. All right. To the theater. Thirty bucks for the ticket. And there's that. Show for Venus. Oh, baby, 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 don't make me hurt so bad. These guys are all stone cold gone for you. You cute, sexy thing. You baby, sing to me. Sing to me only, baby. Venus, just sing and I can die a happy man. I want to hold you tight. Oh, goodness. Certainly glittery.
We had someone try to crash the stage. Let's do this. Ah, you're a friend of the Runaway Five. You come to see Miss Venus, come inside quickly. Let's do this. Oh, you want an autograph? Okay, I'll give you my autograph on this banana peel. The signed banana. Oh, this is a bonus. A kiss. Yay. go. Hopefully I don't need to pay again for the dinosaur museum, but I will if I, I have to. I was already in here. I already paid you. Okay. I gotta get it again. You know what? No. Because I know what's coming. I'll get the money from um, the hotel instead of the department store. Because then I can heal up. 75 a night, right? So that's $300 there. Yep, 300 bucks. This is a unique service here to read you today's headline. The Foresight Post says, Yikes, I made a mistake and bought a newspaper called Foresight Star. Let me read the thing. Lucky of the Runaway Five, found to have been in the State House of Representatives. That's got to be a lie. Save. And try to get me some uh, more levels. Dinosaur Museum. Pay our 20 bucks. And let's go. You know, there's a new singer. All right, you bring your autograph on Oh, if you can get her autograph on anything, don't worry. Don't care. Whatever. Oh, I got to show him. Okay. We can do that. Goods. Signed banana. You got it. That banana peel is an authentic Venus autograph. Yep, there's no doubt about it. Now for my promise. I'll tell you about something extraordinary. In the next room, there is a light shining from far, far below the manhole. There I found a huge monster rat. I'm trying to pull your Legos. Go ahead and see it. Check it for yourself. Okay. Down we go. We're in the sewers. What's in this room? Moving trash cans. 
stinky ghosts. Okay. Um, I'm going to hit them with fire, but I'm going to spy one to see what we're working with. Vulnerable to fire, flash, paralysis, open hypnosis. Okay, fire is the answer here. Um, hit him hard, harder then. And life up Paula. Now I've got two healers. So that's good. Poo to 24, offense 5, defense 4, speed 1, guts 1, vitality 1, IQ 1, luck 1, HP 8, PP 2, brain shock alpha. Cool. What's in here? A broken iron, which went to Jeff, which is good because that's who should be having it. Deadly mouse. Hit the deadly mouse. Fire the, st the front row. Spy the Deadly Mouse. Uh, life up Paula. Mouse. Vulnerable to fire. Cool. Okay. That should take the ghost out. And I can't target the possessed sucker. Poo to 25, HP 2. Okay, can't go any further that way. Deadly Mouse. Two of them. Hit them hard. Poo froze. Okay. Well, we... Ouch! Okay. Jeff to 40. Offense 4. Defense 1. Guts 2. Vitality 1. IQ 1. HP 8. Poo to 26. Offense 3. Defense 2. Speed 1. Vitality 1. IQ 1. HP 13. PP 2. We'll take it. Hello, Dan Mack. How you doing today? These guys are fire. I am well working for a bit. Just popping in to see what I'm in for in the future. Fair enough. Does not have any PP. That's good to know. Okay. Heal him. Okay. Get this stinky ghost out. Okay. 
Fire Alpha, and a Life Up Alpha on Paula. That'll do it. Paula to 39, Offense 1, Speed 1, HP 1. We'll take it. In here. Nothing on the bottom, but up on top is a croissant. Looks like we gotta go in the water. After fighting a stinky ghost. Let's see what Freeze does to it. A little bit. But we'll take it. Level 27 for Pooh. Defense 2, Speed 1, HP 1, and Magnet Omega. Into the water. I want to check that room out, but first we got to fight this critter. A filthy attack roach. What's Mirror do? Cookie Breath could not turn into the... Okay. Uh, life up on Paula. Given, um... Given Pooh can't attack very well, the smart move might be to use Pooh as my healer. Nest of 45, defense 1, HP 2, PP 1. Through the sewer water. Up. Let's see what we got here. Another roach. After this fight, I think I'm taking an ad break. Ooh! We're at least getting into that room first. We're going to fight this, then we're going to take the attack break. The ad break. Uh, PSI, use the rocket. Use the good fire. And life up beta on Ness. Okay. One goes away. Now I've got a problem. I got two ghosts. Pooh to 28. Offense 7. Defense 2. Speed 1. Guts 1. Vitality 1. IQ 1. Luck 2. Max HP to 14. PP by 5. And what's in here? There is a broken spray can. Nice. We're going to pause. We're going to take a 60-second ad break. I'll see you at the end of it.
All right, we are back. Off we go. Gonna have to go in the water again. The deadly mouse and the stinky ghost. Okay. We're gonna hit him hard with that. We're gonna fire the front row. We're gonna shoot. We're gonna try to do that. Jeff needs some health. So we'll do that. Okay. Missed me. I know there's a butterfly room. Oh, I don't have enough PP. Okay. Magnet death mouse. Wait. PSI freeze. I can run the, the cheap one. And then I can run a freeze also on him. Oh boy. The ghost goes away. Get this mouse out. And I am getting out of here because I don't think I have a way to... Hold on. I have a cup of life noodles. That'll get me through this. Um, give that. Give that. And then Jeff can use the cup of life noodles on poo. There we go. Is that an enemy or is that a... That's an item, I believe. There we go. Just a deadly mouse. Okay. Get the deadly mouse out. There's a healing room around here somewhere. I am suspecting it's this room here. Don't want to fight them. See, sometimes you can scroll scroll enemies off the screen. Call it a 40. Offense 3, defense 1, speed 2, guts 2, vitality 1, IQ 2, life, luck 2, HP 11, PP 8, and offense up Omega. There we go. Into the room. It's empty. Yep, that's the healing room. Okay. Let's see how many of these I'm going to need. Um, 99, 119, so at least two, three. Paula needs eight. So. Life up Paula. Paula's is 150. Yeah, so we're going to... 
PSI, Life Up, Jeff and Paula. And Ness. And now we're going to use it. And we got to use this a few times. But we are all fully healed now. So it's just grabbing psychic points at this point. Yeah, her match her, her top is 150. So we need to do five more of these at least. She's full now. I just want to see the, the, the healing rules again. Sunstroke. Yeah, poisonings, nausea, feeling strain, uncontrollable cry. It cannot get rid of possessed. Now we go. Yeah, fight one. Stinky ghost ain't going to be too bad. We're going to do it cheaply, though. Bonus of, of solidifying is that it's getting me free runs. Uh oh. Okay. Who to twenty nine defense one HP one. Eleven thou, twenty-five thou. Jeff's almost at a level. Who's ten thou away? Okay. Let's go. We're gonna stay in, out of the water. This is three deadly mice. Yeah, this I'm calling for that, and I'm gonna run a fire on him. Because this way I hit them all. Oh crap. Okay. Um, yeah, she's going to survive. But we're going to life her up. We're trying to. Oh, we got one out. Mm -hmm. 
We may have to do it without Paula. Jeff to 41, speed 1, IQ 1, luck 1, HP 2. Okay. Healing beta to... Yeah, healing beta for Ness. All right. Wait, what was in that room? A broken bazooka. Yeah, that's good. Roach ain't terrible. Get rid of this roach. Nest to 46. Speed 1, Vitality 1, HP 12, PP 2. Poo to 30. One, defense 1, HP 3. Okay. I have a feeling the rat is coming. Oh, there it is. Roach ain't terrible. To the fifth, your sanctuary location. We are getting it. Plague Rat of Doom. Hit him hard. Uh, okay, do not have anything here. Well, we use a shield killer just in case. Did not work. That means there wasn't one. Body solidified. Okay, so he's going to be able to do nothing the next turn. Sick again. Bl body solidified. That worked. So that's a free move. Spy him real quick. Send them both. We'll see which one gets it. Ugh. Yeah, 
got 14 there. Shoot it. Freeze it. Come on. Solidified is fine. Became tame! We've done it! Nesta 47, offense 2, defense 1, guts 2, vitality 1, IQ 1, HP 15, PP 2. Jeff to 42, defense 1, HP 1, level 31 for Pooh, offense 2, defense 3, speed 2, HP 2, PP 2. Level 32, offense 4, defense 3, guts 2, vitality 2, IQ 1, HP by 24, PP by 3. Another level, offense by 1, speed 1, HP 2, PP 1, and freeze Gamma. Up we go. Alert, Ness's condition is critical. That's fine. Ness saw a baby's bottle, but just for an instant. And I get a carrot key. Okay, out of the dungeon, everyone's going to run away. And that's fine, because I really don't want to fight right now. Forty, forty-two, and thirty-three. That's not a bad spread. Just stay in the water. Yeah, it's a filthy attack route. We'll try to get it quick. Here's the exit. And we got a carrot key. Gee, I wonder what we use the carrot key for. Probably those rabbit statues. So our next stop is Dalam. And we're going to go there, and then we're probably going to end it there. Oh, good. It's Dan Mac's favorite character. The photographer. All right. This path looks nice and easy. But before we teleport there, we're going to go to winters real quick. 
and get some items there. It's me again, that chewing gum. My husband left here to go play with Tessie along the shore of Lake Tess. That's fine. In here... Yeah, let's pull all, almost all the money. Hold on. Goods. Give that to Pooh. And... No. Give... Now we can buy the T-Rex's bat. And the non-stick fry pan. There we go. Nope, nothing else. Okay. Now we're going to go do the teleport, but this time we're going to teleport with Pooh to Dalam and use this spell because it uses less space. picture. Alright. I think I can rest in here. I could be wrong. And another picture. Don't be careless. That is a heal. Everybody is fully healed now. But it's not asleep. Okay. We got Ness 34,000, Paul 22,000, Jeff 34,000, Pooh 12,000. Save. And we're going to end. All right, this is going to conclude this stream. Um, I will be back playing Earthbound next Thursday at 10.30 in the morning, Eastern Standard Time. Next stream is going to be Tuesday, the 12th of December. Uh, 10.30 in the morning, and we're going to be continuing The Lost Vikings 2. Um, if you were here for a little bit or a lot, thank you very much for stopping in. Please feel free to follow or subscribe if you like what you saw. Now i got to find someone to send you guys to. Let me see. Who's open? Hey, let's send you to Ellen. Why not? No. Let's send you to Tad. Let's send you to Tad. He, I haven't, street, haven't rated him in a while. So I will see you over there. Without further ado, playing Dead by Daylight, it's Tad Nugent 1. <laughs>